Okay, welcome everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Here we are in Isle of Men. All right, we are uh, here out and about. And uh, I got my team with me. As you can tell by my uh, level, I'm now level 180 thanks to that uh, trip to the volcano. And uh, I was, uh, you know, me and everybody else uh, was uh, killing uh, those, uh, you know, sorcering uh, constructs, the golems, and they were giving us levels out like crazy. So all my thralls are like level 124, level 8, level whatever. We only got a new guy. Uh, he was a he was a gift. This guy. I saw him with my team. Uh, parked with my team. And I'm like, what is he doing here? And I'm like, oh, well, you know. He's probably a gift. So I'm going to... I outfitted him. I got them all into the Nordheimer epic. We finally, being that uh, past level 60, finally went ahead and made Nordheimer epic for every everyone there. Uh, and, uh, got them all upgraded to the obsidian since we learned obsidian weapons in the volcano. All right. That being said, um, and I made sure that all the weapons had armor penetration. And if they didn't have armor, then I, uh, fitted them with armor penetration. So, so they could penetrate armor and do better damage that way. Um, that's our... Lamp lighter? Okay. And, um. Oh. Oh. Aww. Okay. Oh. Oh. Rock nose figurines. Aww. Alright. Now, being that uh, I seem to be the only one in the server today. <laughs> okay. There we go. <laughs> okay, that so just happened, didn't it? Ho ho ho! Let me uh. I, I had uh, actually. That's the reason why I got ice on my uh, bar is to. Because uh, I thought we were gonna go back to the volcano with everyone tonight, and uh, no one's showing up, so. That's okay. They'll give us time to go out and explore. Wait for me, wait for me, wait for me. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Me, 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 me. <laughs> oh, hi, Jake. <laughs> I want to talk about me, want to talk about I. Well, well, let's talk about you. What about you? Do you want to talk I'm about? Jake Nova. I'm Jake Nova. <gasps> really? And I found a bear the size of a house. Really? <gasps> nice. This hey, bear is huge. I've never seen a bear this big in in Conan before. Is that close to our base? Is that what the bear that you're talking about? Yep. Yeah, I knew it. It's where all that hops and leveling agent is, right? Yep. Yep. <laughs> he is big. Oh yeah. <laughs> His teeth are the size of my swords. Uh, I, 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 I know. I fought him a couple of times and died to him every single time. <laughs> yep, yep. I know exactly who you're talking about. Okay, so um, I just outfitted, the, gave them a new outfit, so I need to get their uh, looks. We don't have fashion to set up over there yet, so I need to give them a sense of fashion here. So let me uh, do all the fighters first. There we go. And then let's... There we go. That's all the fighters right there. Okay. Yep. Fighters look good. They look handsome. Now let me take these pants and those shoes. Oh, well, actually, just the shoes. Yes, there we go. They got their own pants. Let me put the 
pants back over here. There we go. And now let's do the archers. There we go. And then there we go. And let's see if we uh, got everybody. Okay. Oh. Okay. Well, not exactly what I put, but you know what? She still looks okay. Oh, I gotta do their. I gotta do their. Uh... Okay. Yeah. I forgot about that. Um, their bracers needs to get dyed. I don't have bracers for them. Maybe I should get bracers for them. Wait, you need to get your thralls bracers? Man, that that could be expensive. You got insurance. <gasps> well, I mean, they, you know, for the arms. The arm guard. Especially the ones that are pirates, because they all have crooked teeth. Yeah, I mean... I guess those bracers look okay. It's just that they need dyed. They need to be dyed. They need to be dyed like purple or something. I don't know. It's it's kind of bugging me a little bit. Wonder if I could just outright dye this. me uh, uh here to here and then do this for the color picker do that uh, is it this one can't see all right die color picker this that no wrong 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 color okay maybe it's this red one I uh, need to die yes it's that one okay uh, and that's the fourth one over on the bottom row all right Let's let's see how that looks. Come here, girl. I mean, it looks better, but I still don't. Oh, where's her shoes? Where were you? What are you doing? Shopping at the Banana Republic? I think so. I, you know, I don't. Get it? Banana Republic? We're on island? Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> I could never shop there. I was always too big. Say. Let's just do... Let's do this. Okay, there she is. Now her bracers do look weird. Um. Hmm. Maybe if I just these are my bracers, so maybe if I just add them. See how they look. bad. You've got like a purple to it. Yeah. Alright. I can live with that. The 
the boys, though? I don't know if I can live with that or not. Let's see how bracers look with the boys. Here. Okay. Fighters. The ball. Switch. This one. That. Dark Nian. Yeah, that looks okay. I, I I can live with that, I think. Yeah. At least they're, you know, they're looking pretty. Oh, is it getting dark again? Yep. It's dark. Hmm. Alright. Let me see. Is our nightly visitor. Our daily corrupted wolf kill, and that gives me an excellent chance to level up this one guy. What is this guy? This, this, where is the? There he is. This guy. Oh, that leveled him up to level three. Nice. Y'all, I do have a strength weapon on me, and I'm eating agility weapon based food. And I better go change that to a strength weapon food. I just realized that. Where is he? Where's Misha? Hi, Misha! Watch out! Hey, my friends! My friends! And thank you for Misha Bites! Oh. <laughs> Oh no. Really? Really? Where are you? What? What? Oh, some of the villagers are coming. I never wanted to be here. There you go.
Okay. Off we go. So while we're waiting for people other than Jake to show up, if they show up, so I don't want to finish the volcano unless they're there. Yeah, I don't want to finish unless they're there. Yeah. I'm good. I ain't that good. <laughs> you, need, you need a whole team of adventure. Right? Buddy, let's go. Okay. All right. Okay. Here we go. Oh, okay, you're in All right. All right. Go with you guys. Yeah. You know? My team is pretty good. They're over level 100, so except for that one. But they're all over. I'm. I'm actually thinking about just going up uh, to. Uh, to the volcano and, and just do those constructs just so I can level up that one thrall. But, uh, I'll do that off camera. Spare everyone the details. Because if I do that, I, I, I will. Ooh, I'm rubber banding like crazy. What? 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 Okay. Okay. Thing seems to be okay now. Now let's. This is the real test. Oh yeah. Huh. Ymir will have your heart out. Tell me your name. Oh okay. I'm getting damage even though he's way, way far away from me. That means timing is off. If that's the case, and the timing's that far off, I'm going to have to quit to main menu, and then come back in. Yeah, ping of 120. I mean... That's the reason why I'm having a whole bunch of problems already. The volcano holds great power. Okay, I'm back in. Okay, did I get it? No, I didn't get it. Still scouting. Here we go. No, did we? Did I? Did we kill everybody over there? I guess we did, cause uh, someone at that campfire. Nice. Nice. Okay. Are, are you at the bear now, Jake? Me? Mm-hmm. Well, my my castle is across the lake from it. Oh, uh, I'm headed down there. Well, You're I'm down here? Oh, you want to kill the bear? Yeah, why not? Let me come over. 
I'm uh I'm at the encampment now. Well, at a encampment, but I'm almost there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Outlander. What's supposed to be like this? Animals. Ha! Wow. My guys are just toasting them now. That's awesome. Damn it. Alright. Um You're at the bear? No, no, uh not yet. I'm I'm like sputtering and and uh everything right now. Um trying to do everything I can to Make it better. So I had to log out. And I'm going to log back in again. I'm hoping by doing this I'm stabbing off. Any. Yeah. Better ping at 94. Better than it was. There we go. If I log out and log back in on my own terms instead of getting kicked out, I, I would prefer that. Oh, Jesus. Well, that was a weird ass fall. All right, I'm at the bear. Grab the bear? Yep. I'm coming, I'm coming. I don't think uh, he cares. Okay, one bear down. The big one is coming up. Oh, let me, uh, harvest them. Ooh. I can't find his bear body. Me to harvest. Oh, there it is. Dead though. 
Holy crap! It was a big bear. Not yeah, a big bear. It is a big bear. How does a bear get that big? How <laughs> does a bear get that big? I mean, look at all those hops and leveling agent. What? How do you think? He's probably ate his way to being that big. I mean, look at all this. I guess while I'm here, I could harvest some of this. Let me see. Here's my, uh... Get some of this leveling agent and... And hops so we can get drunk later and have a nice party. Go woohoo! Oh, there's a baby! Hi, baby! We can, uh, I was, uh, I got the first level. Baby? There's a baby. There's a baby bear right here. Oh, on him. they're everywhere. He's right in front of me! I've not picked him up yet! I tried picking him up. I the first I level of my uh, castle gun. Oh, there he, there he is. There he is. He's underneath this hops bush. But if I uh, harvest that hops bush, he'll die. Gonna clear the whole island? So that's an awful lot of hops and leaving agent. <laughs> I like my parties. I like getting drunk. I like to drink a lot. What can I say? Oh, somebody <laughs> joined the server. Yeah. Say hi to Ray for me. Tell him that Talia says hi. <laughs> awesome. Now you know, if you want, I got the first level of my castle complete right here. Uh -huh. I was gonna do a purge so that way I can try to get me a bartender. Because Ooh. I gotta have a tavern because every every adventure starts on tavern. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Let's do a let's do a um, purge. Oh my, uh, all my thralls are having fun with the uh, local. Yeah. You guys having fun with the locals? What are you doing in there? Leave the locals alone, for Christ's sakes. Oh, here's your castle. Oh, cool. It's just the first level of it. Still, yeah, yeah. Still working on it. Nice. It takes a little while to get still consolidated and stuff going. Well, you you know our nightly visitors can swim, right? You you know that. Yeah, but they won't come in here for some reason. And I raised the drawbridge; they can't get in. I haven't yet to see him come in. Uh, one actually. Uh was in our uh he just spawned in in our base uh up in the treehouse after i uh after uh streaming i was like what we were kind of shocked that uh that happened so uh, we it hasn't happened since so i'm thinking that maybe that was some kind of a fluke or something we don't know 
All right, I would put a bedroll down, but I can't put a bedroll down because it's up at the, uh, it's currently up at the volcano. You could put a bed down. Uh, bed? I can't do that because I got a bed down. Uh, well, all you got to do is because your base is, the treehouse is right up the hill from me. I'm just down the hill from it. Yeah, but okay. You could just jump down that hill if you needed to. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. It's easier said than done in this... on this map. <laughs> oh yeah, you, you've made the bar right here. Nice. Get the bartender ready. Yeah, well I just got some things kind of randomly placed everywhere right now until I get the rest of the... Castle. Nice, nice. You ever seen how I do my vault? Um, no. See me right here? Come down here. This is my vault room down here. Oh, neat! Okay, that's your, uh... Ah! Sweet! Alright! I very rarely, uh, do anything with it. Ever since that we put on the stack size plus, we don't really, uh play with the bolts anymore. Oh, yeah, it's an easy way to drop all your junk. Cool. Mm -hmm. Well, that's going to be my fishing uh, place, you know. Or my bathhouse, I guess you could say. Ooh. It's not done. I'm just working on it a little. Nice. Or your water dungeon. Yeah, my Got water it. dungeon. Water dungeon, you know? Okay. okay. We get so a piece of this. treasure. Are we gonna do this? Do we have a? Yeah. You want to start I'm... off easy and then work your way up? I want to start off with one. Okay. With one. So that would just be like one piece of gold or something. Yeah, just throw a minimum amount there. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right. Oh, and then I figure I just. And I'll close this door here, but I'll have to leave the drawbridge down, or they won't. No, they won't they'll come in. Yeah. Like, yeah. Do you have uh? Where do you keep your wood at? My wood. Yeah. I don't think I. The. Uh, you don't have the, any. Uh, carpenter bench. I, I might have thrown it in the vault. Oh, okay. Let me uh. Let me before you do anything. Let me uh. Harvest a little bit of wood. Yeah, I think I dumped it all in the vault. I just need a little bit. Just a little bit. There we go. Okay. This way I can, uh, repair my torch. Oh, you know, I did forget to, uh, get the, uh, strength boost. There we go. Strength weapon damage. Now I got that. Extremely drunk pirate. <laughs> yeah, I got her over in the pirate area. There's actually pirates over there that are extremely drunk. <laughs> That's hilarious. Look at it. That's hilarious. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> okay. Declare your wealth. Buddy, declare your will. We'll see if this works. I'm really 
curious if it's gonna work or not. Never tried it having a drawbridge before. Uh, I'm hearing something in the water. Yeah, probably a sea monster. Did they spawn it? Oh, I just heard it come up. Do you see where it's at? Oh uh, yeah, right here to our right. Oh. So far so good, it's working. Yeah. Are they gonna run in the water? They're running in the water. The, just a shallow part. Uh, yeah. so, enemies at the gate! By the smelly bear, invader. Hey, 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 Lag spike? Lag spike? Did you hit a lag spike? Yeah, or I'm getting dumped out. Okay. Yeah, I just got dumped out. I still see you in here. Oh, that's a Freya. Better check on the doors, make sure nobody gets in the doors. Nope, doors are good. Your, your thralls are so high level, nothing affects them. <laughs> oh, that's what I was looking for. But we'll see, because when we uh, was down there, those Yagites, they got me. I was in the... Uh-oh. There's a boogeyman. Uh-oh. He's a dead boogeyman. I'm hearing stuff, but I can't do anything about it. Oh, I got gotcha. you. I'm here. Victory. Exile. Oh. Wow. Bartender? Are you bartender? No, who are you? Janos is like. <laughs> who are you? Alright, so where's where's my archer? No. Oh there she is. No uh nope. No bartender on this round. Okay. Are you are you able to access this chest? Um, I don't have any keys. But I unlocked it, so you should be able to get into it, right? I mean, it's I not really. It's just junk loot, really. I don't even see anything. Okay, there we go. So yeah, take a hole. Well, nothing really. And take a hole. All right, there we go. Got it. No bartender this round, though. 
Why are the archers still going at us? I don't know, that's your... Your Freya shooting that. Everybody shooting everybody, I don't know why. Well, this you're this shooting, one's gonna go down. You shooting healing arrows? You shooting healing arrows at the archers? Oh, that's all I got. <gasps> there we go. There you go. I did what you couldn't, Freya. Stupid girl. Okay, I'm gonna start another one. So there were there were no uh. No bartenders in that one. Okay. Do you want to just break this guy's bond? Oh yeah. No, no. He's just a. Two exile. Yeah, he's only a level one. Just take whatever's off of him and uh, break his bonds and Strangely, let him be. I don't get any options to break his bonds. I don't know why. Really? Yeah, I don't get any options to break his bonds. That's why I don't understand. It's... Are you able to do it? Yeah, here. Hold on. No reachable location. Yep. We're gonna have to wait for the other camp to despawn first. I think that's the only place they can build. Which I kinda like. That's weird. I know where it was... I know where it was... Yeah, see, there's no breakable bonds. That's why it was like... Oh, there it goes. That's what... Did it come up? Yeah. There you go. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh, yeah. I made him follow me, then I made him unfollow me, and then that's when I saw it. That's why I've been leaving a lot of, of those just out there. Well, I think we have to wait for that camp right there to disappear. Before we yep, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that's the only camp. place yeah. that the camp will spawn here. Which is nice, because I could just aim the trebuchets and everything straight out there and just bombard it to death. Do a level 10 and just drop a few demons. I mean, technically it can come out over here, too. There's uh, plenty of uh, open land over here for it to spawn in. Now, these are the only three foundations? Yeah, I only have foundations. Those aren't, these here aren't foundations. These aren't foundations. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, wait, well, ju just these three right here, and then these three up here are uh, Regular? ceiling tiles. Okay, yeah. okay. These three here are foundations. I put that for support because I'm probably going to put another gate on this end right here to protect me. Okay, okay. And then. Just, uh, these squares here are foundations for the gates. Okay. Everything else... And, and, uh, so... Is on floors. So, the reason why, folks, you're wondering why I was concerned about the foundations... Jake, you want to tell them? Oh, yeah. Foundations, can, uh, the more foundations you have, the more server lag it can cause. Because that stuff has to spawn in. And what's my number one rule? No foundations. Nice. Good boy. <laughs> the only foundations allowed are the ones for gates, because for some reason, uh, gates won't place onto ceiling tiles. You gotta exactly. Have to place them so it, the gates only uh, take three ceiling tiles max to uh, be able for you to place one down. So, uh, yeah. And, and so you're, you're allowed only three foundations. How to build without foundations. But the rest of the yeah. rest of the build has to, to be build done without foundations. Uh, usually. So for those of you who'd like to come in, this is an uh, open public server, hard. but so, uh, like... there's only one rule, one rule only, and that is no foundation. No foundation. Mm -hmm. So we catch you with foundations. Uh, you'll get like a five day uh, warning uh, to change it. And if you don't change it, then the uh, then the whole entire base will be absolutely deleted. And there's no exceptions. 
And no favoritism either. Okay. These guys. And if you're asking how to build without foundations, uh, the key to that is, and, and you can watch this on anybody's videos that has Yeah, buildings. watch any of my videos. It's uh, pil you, uh, pillars and ceiling tiles. And then I outline yeah. the... Uh, well, a lot of people, they'll, they'll use the base plate. You put down fence foundations. And then uh, once you got your outline with fence foundations, you put the ceiling tiles on it. Yeah, I, I do it the other way. I I, I start off with the uh, see. Uh, I start off with the pillars and ceiling tiles. And once I get the main base built, that's when I start filling in mm -hmm. with fence foundations around the edge, to make it look more solid. You know what I mean? So that's what I do or how I do it. But everyone's different. There's no right or wrong way to doing it. You know, as long as it looks good at the end, that's all that matters, right? Okay, or uh, I think we might be able to do my it. base when I'm done. This is just the first level. Yeah, I can't wait to see okay, this. Okay, it disappeared. Okay, yeah, let's try. Okay, let's see what happens here. The thing I like about having the drawbridge for this. If I'm doing like a level 10 purge or something and I get overwhelmed and I, I'm afraid they're going to decimate my base, I could just always just raise the drawbridge to where they can't reach me. Oh yeah, and then they'll stop the thing, can't. And then the purge will just it's like, oh, we can't reach. Oh, uh, it's behind this Where'd tree. They I heard it. It's behind this big tree. tree. Yeah. The, I uh, kind of knew. Yep, there it is. It's right in that spot where I said it is nice and open spot. Oh wow. Yep, you're right. Here they come, here they come. Oh here they come. They're coming on the other side. Ah! Ah! Uh oh. Ah! I think I got uh... I think I'm lagged. Or rubber banding, or something is going on. I can't open that one. Do you have keys? 
Yep, yep, I just picked him up. Kind of got to make my way through this mess of uh, foliage here. <laughs> Let's see, that looks like a bartender. Please, yes, you will not leave <laughs> much time, I promise. I have uh, no, a proposition. He, yeah, he is a barkeeper. Nice. Congratulations! I am in your debt. Ooh, I can be quite and the cell sword. Yes. <laughs> I know yeah. the right rough and tumble. And then, I only got one key left. I opened up this. Eh, not much. In junk. I'll, I'll, like, I'll, I'll pick. Your heart. Yeah. All right, let's uh, take this back to base. Oh, there's another cage on this side. This is the answer to it. I didn't see this cage on this side. I don't have any more keys though. I only had three. Five cages and only three keys. Sorry, dude. Ooh, get back to the castle. It's getting dark. You got the uh, tavern guy? No. I thought you had him. Or you already got your max followers, don't you? Yeah, hey, I got my max followers, so I can't have any more. I get him. I get him. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where do you go? Where do you go? There he is. <laughs> I know, right? I still got PTSD with that thing. Thanks, stars, for the PTSD. Jesus. <laughs> Did you get him? Now you got some place to place your extremely drunk pirate. Set your pirate on the seat there so she can enjoy some more drink. There we go. Nice. Although that's not really where I'm going to put this thing. I just I thought yeah. I just got things plopped down right here. Well, so you know, let let your things. drunkard pirate enjoy herself and sit her down and have a good have a good time here at the at the bar. There you go. Oh yeah, is she all happy now? <laughs> oh yeah, she already ordered a yeah, tanker right? of uh, mammoth piss already. <laughs> I heard it was invoked. I was thanked for something, but I missed it. Oh, hi, <laughs> hi, Darth. How are you? <laughs> well, Shh, don't not tell bad. what I said. <laughs> I was tr I was I well I, I can guess. I was waiting for you guys to go back to the dungeon. I, I caught your prior stream of of where you were at, and I was waiting to see um, where you went. We're waiting for the rest of our. Uh, uh, yeah, we we don't want to right. Show Going up. In. Yeah, I mean, because there was like uh, five or six of us, and now there's only two. So I guess they're. Bit they weren't available tonight, so we're just going to explore and uh, experience some uh, new stuff today. Like uh, we're, we did the purge for the first time in, in your, you know, in. Yeah, we just uh, did our first purge. So. Yeah, I was seeing that. I was actually, I was curious because, um, you know, the purge needs. Needs space. Air. Yeah, yeah. In space, and so I, I've been curious because I was, I you know, there's there is plenty of space between trees all over the place, but yeah. I'm always curious where people like to build. Is there enough flat space? That kind of thing. Right. In my castle in the middle of the lake. Yeah. Yeah. There's there's a uh, there's uh, I was curious about that too because they they purged now. Did they did they path to your to your base? They um, were able to pass, yep. Yeah. As long as I have the drawbridge down. Because I have a drawbridge too. Yeah. As long as I have the drawbridge down. Yeah. Yeah, there's a there's there's a thing and I don't know if it's fixed yet. There there is a, a thing in the game where if you have a gate and sometimes people like to put stairs leading immediately down from their gate. 
Yeah. There there was a pathing problem with that. I don't I don't know if it's fixed yet, but the uh but the quick solution if if people have path problems is just to stick a couple foundations right in front of the gate so that it transitions from foundation to gate and right. then they can they can path up and in. Right, right. So one of those things. Because uh, it may work with uh, it may work with ceiling tiles right in front of a gate. I don't know, but it does not. It did not work as of want to say two patches ago. So I don't know how it works now. And, and I've noticed that because I mean, she has her service where uh, she did allow uh, foundations. Yeah. Yeah, I heard that. I was I was listening in, and I was I was busy in the dev kit. I was listening <laughs> to what you guys were doing, but yeah, yeah. This is uh, you know, we just wanted to make sure that all the new people that are coming in know, uh, you know, once again, we don't use foundations. We only use this, you know, ceiling tiles and pillars, and then use the fence foundation. Yeah, we use the foundations for the yeah. gates. Yeah, for gates. I guess. And uh, everyone's there's actually free so so what. Yeah. Well, lag can actually be quite a complicated thing because, really, it, it, it's very difficult to isolate it to one thing. Um, yeah. Generally, generally speaking, it's it's everything together. And the biggest transgression most people make when it comes to server lag is they keep everything. Yeah. Because when you're when you're coming in to range on somebody's base, and you'll notice if you if it's some if it's an old base that somebody's been hoarding for forever and a day, it takes time and, to work all that back into the uh, yeah, it takes a lot of time. Yeah. yeah, but there have been some changes to the way they do the game loading that that may be mitigated now. I don't know if you've noticed, but a, a couple of patches ago, um, the way base is loaded from a distance, like you could notice it visually changed. It used to be. When you would come up on a base, you would see workstations pop in, and you would see the walls come up around it. You would see it kind of phase in. Right. On that. Yeah, I you remember, I remember that. Right. Yeah. And, now, and now that stuff loads later. Yeah. And so, yeah, it's like the walls load first now. The walls load first, and then when you open the doors to your base, the stuff that's inside loads. And so, really, in a way, you know, it, it puts the lag on the transgressor. <laughs> because if you're a hoarder or you're a obsessive decorator and and your your hardware is enough to snap, well, you're the one that suffers when you pop open the doors and there's plants and all kinds of stuff everywhere. So I, it, prefer, uh, it the, right. I prefer it that way because I mean, like it it seems better to me. I don't know. No, I mean, and while there's... I was just noticing with her, like she she'd been doing fine, but then as soon as the purge popped in, she started lagging. Yeah, and that may have something to do with uh, it looking for a path because, and and in 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 that regard, it could have something to do with map layout. You know, it's one of those things where it's got to find paths, and I, I don't understand how the logic goes because I don't have any exposure to that that I'm yeah, aware I mean, of within the kit. Even in the test I lot, I would uh, lag code, but... horribly during a purge. Yeah, uh, lag horribly. Rubber banding, things not spawning in fast enough. So, you know, if I die and I and I uh, spawn back at my uh, bedroll that's at the uh, earth base, um, mm -hmm. like the doors wouldn't spawn in until like almost five minutes later, till like after the purge. So I'm stuck inside the base because yeah. I can't open the doors because there's no doors for me to open. Technically. So, yeah, purging right. on my little system is, is kind right, of right. difficult, but it yeah, has been easier lately. There's a, there's a client side aspect. So, mm -hmm. that's good. I mean, it, it has been a little easier lately. Yeah, there's a. Yeah. There's a, there's kind of a there's two ends to some of this stuff where it's, there's things that have to happen on the client that has to do with accessing your hard drive whether or not you have an NVMe a solid state or some people are still running on mechanicals oh, and God. yeah yeah so so there's that there's how fast it loads into your RAM how fast the CPU can handle it and then on the server side there's all the computer the computations that take place 
that has to do with now I would think almost all the purge stuff happens server side um, because it's computing over the terrain and things like that but who knows maybe it's shared a little bit with the client I'm not real I'm not privy to that I haven't really looked into it but right right but the uh, hardware top to bottom on both on both ends can matter a lot sorry I'm outside smoking my pipe because you know that's what I do when I want to relax <laughs> That's okay. Well, it's all about having fun and uh, relaxing. <laughs> yeah, Isle Man's very relaxing. Yeah, uh, well, As you well, discovered you know, it. You know, for me, the, I'm being stressed out. Walk in the jungle. You know, me with my PTSD at nighttime. Thank you, Darth, for that. Thank you. <laughs> Give me that PTSD <laughs> like that. Shame yeah, on you. Oh, those are. Oh. Those, will get, those will get easier in the future because I'll add other hard things to the map and they'll make up for it. Ah. Uh. Uh. Oh. Uh. You're such a sadist. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I was actually, just before I hopped on, I was working on a new, new cave complex. <laughs> well, Isle of Men... Isle of Men is for that player that feels the game is too easy. Yep. And I've been in that camp for a little while, but easy is probably the wrong word for me. I just, I look for more challenge. <laughs> so, yeah. it's all it's all in the spirit of getting the most out of the game. Because, <laughs> you know, you know, the... the base game has to cater to a lot of people right yeah. it's got to have the, it's got to cast the widest possible net it's got to you know the you you want to add your pvp ears your pv ears and your rp ears and yeah well and the main thing they want to draw new players right and so yeah. those of us who've been playing for thousands of hours mm -hmm. we know we know where everything is we know what's around on the base map we know what's around every corner and you know, so what's when, in every chest and every yeah, what every yeah. NPC drops and yeah, and you know when you're going into New Asgard, you know you go to the you go to the left and there's a couple fighters sitting there. There's a smelter. There's a blacksmith. There's an archer around the corner. You know where yeah. every little thing is. All right. So you you get a system down, and and you know the the knowledge of where everything is starts over after a couple thousand hours. It just becomes rote. Whereas a new a new player hopping in, you know they don't they don't know where anything is, and they they find certain things extremely difficult. I mean, e even us old timers are having a hard time keeping our thralls alive right now. Oh you know? yeah, and that's part of the that's part of the deal. Uh, and that with the loot time. refresh was awesome. I'm glad that they did the loot refresh. Loot was so like mm. boring and didn't even want to loot all the chests. Yeah anymore you know but now you never know what you're gonna yeah. get it's and not I, a box it just fits yeah and and well, you can things like I, i'm not a big decorator myself so a, so yeah. now when i'm looting around i find a like hey i found this thing i can stick it up on the wall i can stick it around my base you know and yep. things that I maybe before i wouldn't mess with i feel when i go looting all the chests i feel like i'm shopping at ikea or something <laughs> me i'm Except loving it me, I, I there's love no it. weird instructions all right i'm going in <laughs> it's dark it's getting dark i'm not I'm, no no uh, you can your friends can show up uh no 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 Shh. so are you are you familiar with the story of the pool of the black one no <laughs> i haven't been to that Pool. I want to know. Yeah, I assume so, that, that's what that black pool is now. So, I can so, see that black pool on the map. Can we just um, the, black the black pool? pool actually, you you can't you can't see it from the map because it's actually down in a cave. It's in a brand new cave that came with with uh, chapter four last week. Oh. I pushed it live. You can see it in the trailer. Mm -hmm. So the, the you, you know there's a when the black one comes up out of the pool in that mm -hmm. trailer, you you can see it. He comes out of it. Um, um, but in a story, there's a Conan story, the, one of the Robert E. Howard original ones, right, where they, and this was the inspiration of the map, 
Yeah, when, when I started the map, probably close to two years ago, uh, the pool of the black one was the story I kind of started with because Conan and Baylet are sailing the seas and they come on this island. And on the island, when them and their pirate crew kind of disembark, it looks nice and everything like that. But then at night, the black ones capture people as kill you, but whatever. I have to take creative liberties. But they <laughs> capture people and they drag them back to the pool. And when they take them to the pool, they turn into miniature figurines. And so in the story, whenever they finally get to the pool, um, there's little figurines lining up all the walls, which when you finally find the pool, you'll notice I pay homage to the story. Um, oh, that, wow. That, you know, they're actually dunking these people into the pool and turning them into the figurines lining the walls. And, yeah, and then the black one is the, I mean, what's the word you want to look for? The, the leader, the boss, whatever. Um, he, he is comes out of the pool and upon his death the actual pool comes alive and floods out and kills some people as they're as they're fleeing but i actually don't mess with the pool in that regard because i don't was know that, i want, I want was that the to book move. that was the riddle of steel no the riddle of steel part is from the movie so i i've got the the movie takes various liberties with the original Conan story, but I've always liked it because it was uh, um, Oliver Stone wrote the screenplay for the original movie. Most people don't know that. Mm -hmm. And and so he kind of took what he considered the spirit of Conan and put it into the screenplay that became the John Milius movie. And it's all about power. It's all about strength of arm and power and, and Conan being... You know, relying purely on his his sword arm, and then the whole riddle of steel with full doom, which is originally a call character, but whatever. Yeah, um, yeah. So, you know, I, I I I I like the movie. I always felt like the movie kind of captured what Conan is, and the stories are great. But you know, people read them different ways. They read the expansion, like the Lynn Carter and the. Spray camp right. versions of them and stuff like that, but I I, mm -hmm. I like the I like kind of the, the vibe that comes from the movie, mm -hmm. so that's that's why I chose to base it the way I did. So it's kind of a mix. Well, but, you did notice I put a event uh, a watch party out for uh, Friday night. Wow. Or, or I'm sorry, Sunday night. Oh, no. oh Sunday night. Sorry. Yeah, Sunday I'll night. Sorry. Sunday. I have to relook at the event. But yeah, but, I'm, I'm psyched. Uh, and it's to, to watch Conan again. So this way I can. <laughs> yeah. With Arnold. I, I love that movie. That that movie is great. I mean, there's there's. It's a product of its time, but but it's it's an underrated movie. Is actually a, you know made with serious intent it's it's like these days when they make a you know they make a conan movie like the oh. jason momoa movie they they kind of i don't know they've gone into the, the modern just it's kind of fantasy it's kind of it's kind of just a adventure adventure time but that original movie takes the character seriously and you know it's Arnold in his early career so maybe his acting isn't the best but whatever it's still well, a great yeah movie. but it, you know it's a cheesy B movie that yeah. you know featured Arnold yeah, and, well, and, and it just took off you know but the, the, well, the more you watch it though you more <laughs> realize there's actually really quality elements to it, it it's yeah. just it's it's just kind of interesting that way that I've seen that movie probably a thousand times but um, it, it it's not one I like I don't notice things I never saw before so, um, I, I think I, I feel like you appreciate that movie more the more that you see it. Yeah. Um, now, if I remember right, they made another movie. Uh, the Destroyer. Called uh, call the Conqueror or something. And uh, that was well, actually supposed to be originally written to be another Conan. Oh, you're thinking the so the the Red Sonya movie. Well, has... there's Red Sonya, but there was another 
uh, another movie called Call the Conqueror. Yeah. And from what I understand, it was actually supposed to be written for Arnold Schwarzenegger to be Conan again. But Schwar uh, Schwarzenegger had moved on to other things. Oh, possibly. Call the Conqueror. Yeah. Yeah, I, I actually never saw that one. I, I haven't, you know, I'm a Conan fan first, you know. <laughs> right. <laughs> Even though Cole is 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 also you know Robert E. Howard, um, I, I'm a I'm a Conan fan first, but um, so there's if it's Conan, I I I grab it up. But the uh, <laughs> the uh, <laughs> have you been watching the whack videos with Red Sonya? <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, he's been doing that lately. I mean. I think they're pretty good. I'm not really much of a Red Sonja fan, though. More so than I am a Conan fan. Ah, I'm stuck in my people! Come on! What the hell? What the hell? <laughs> we're walled in. <laughs> I'm walled in! Ah! Can I... Oh, I can't even get... for another purge? Uh, I now, all, now I went out and about. Okay, so they changed, oh, oh, they changed the commands a little bit. Is there a way they? Thank God for that. Can you command them to move away from you? Yeah, uh, there was a throw. Uh, uh, NPC that came you around. You have the better throws. Uh, I'm out. I was going to say if, you're, if they got you trapped, it. you could. Huh? I'm you're out exploring around. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she's headed off to the uh, south uh, east. It looks looks like. Uh, um, you know where I need guys? to take you? What? I need it. Let me come get you, and let's go over to the blood mine of DP. You gotta yeah. check out the blood mine. Uh, uh, yeah, you, you need to branch out. <laughs> There's so many undiscovered places. I know. I mean, that's why actually I'm you can see. Right now. Um, it, it, I'm trying to walk around, but I keep rubber banding like crazy right now. It's like I rubber band, I stop and wait for it to stop, and then I, once it seems to be calmed down, then I'll move again. I I just got. Yeah. Really I think you're gonna have to give me another hint on where to go to find a delving bench. Well, okay, so let, let, I guess you're in a still spot a little bit here. Um, I don't think there's any ambushers. Um, if you go to the map, I can kind of explain some stuff. Okay. Maybe I have a little bit of a delay because we're talking oh. audio and there's a uh, video. Hold on. All right. So let's see. They're, they're killing. Yep, no they're problem. killing people. Hold on. Hold on. I Death to the Outlander. Yep, I see blood on you. Something. Oh, oh, no. it's, it's your average forum user. Well, they're dead now. Oh, wait, no, they're still in <laughs> Yeah, my team uh, protected me while I was out. Okay. All right. All right, I'm, All I'm right, in the map. So if, if we. Uh, yeah, so if, if when you look at the map and you see the original, what I what we all collectively refer to as Noob Cove. Um, the, the terrain is actually designed in such a way to kind of guide you towards the easiest spot because when you go to the south, the cliffs are very sharp. Right. And, the, and the only way to easily go up is through an area of locusts, and which is, it doesn't look like- poisonous. Yeah, and so that's kind of, that's kind of the cue that this way is hard. So, yeah, that's the path of the pest. Yeah. Yeah, the path well, of the pest. Where's the right? noob cove so at? It, is is that where uh, Yog is now? It's right there in your mind. It's where you mess, spawn. Yeah. Go 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 yeah. up on the map, and uh, it's just the cove. Yeah. Oh, over here. So where we spawned in. Up. The starter area is called. The starter no, area is called. Out, the where Yog is. Yeah, where Eaters of the Dead and Swimmer's Refuge might nod to sit right there. Yeah, right there. So the yeah, cove. Right mm -hmm. Yeah. And the path just goes up cove. towards all the pirate area. Yeah, like so. And stuff, yeah. yeah, so the land gently slopes towards the north to kind of guide a player that, well, this is the path of least resistance, and this is 
this is the way that you're that is going to progress more naturally for people in terms of difficulty. So you're going to hit your your exile camps start out right there above the cove. Mm-hmm. There's a there's a shanty town that's in there that's yeah, full, full, full yeah full of a bunch Temple of, of old rum the great yeah. Stygian mine yeah the the, the, the brewer's cabin mine. the brewer's yeah. cabin. I've yeah, not Great seen City any of those. To revisit um, later. You're talking about up north up there? <laughs> yeah, that, that whole northeastern area. Right. Yeah, you need to go north stand in the goes. soup line. You got to go stand in the soup line, I tell you. Yeah, yeah. Oh. There's the, the soup line. So the, so after the exiles, if you're, if you're up on the northeastern shore, the north-northeastern shore, that's where most of the pirates have congregated. Yep. And, and then as you kind of go around counterclockwise to the map, you, you kind of carry through the various factions and whatnot so that, that you would hit stuff like you first you hit the exiles, then you hit the pirates, then you hit the Lemurians, then you hit the relic hunters. And then you kind of, you kind of go through, and then there's various, um, various surge NPCs that have certain camps. And then, you know, there's the, the desert area, which I don't think you've gone to yet. That's the, a pocket on the map that yeah. the hur- hurricane doesn't touch. You know, you got the dogs of the desert over there. Yeah. And, and then you've got the, uh, the Sumerians are actually down in the far right corner of the map. I and so, so, yeah, they, they each have their own little zone. And, uh, so the difficulty kind of progresses in two ways. One is is it's more difficult as you go counterclockwise around the map, and then it's also more difficult as you go outward in. And so the the cannibals tend to be congregated around the volcano because, well, they're they're cannibals. They kind of worship a volcano kind of thing. Um, and so as you as you get in towards the middle, it also becomes more difficult. Um, and I, you guys, I know you went up the volcano, so I, I assume you went past the uh, votaries of Skelos on your way up there. Yeah. Um, I think I saw the bodies littering them, littering ahead of, of Tylee at the end of the night. Um, <laughs> so, you know, they're... they're we you know, they're, they're all kind of... the volcano. The first time yeah. I tried climbing up the volcano, it took me forever. It was a long yeah. journey. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a long ride. <laughs> Yeah. Now I, you know, though, the only hint I'll give you about the uh, about the delving stuff mm-hmm. is it's somewhere in the vicinity of the pirate Lemurians. It's somewhere over in that zone. Ooh. Um, you'll 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 find a you'll come across a, a building that just reeks of sorcery, and there's there's a little. There's some sorcerers in there doing something interesting, um, and so there's a visual cue as you kind of walk up that there's something special going on that they're doing. Oh. Of course, it, it doesn't result in a game mechanic, um, but there's a lot of things I place around the map that I know why they're doing what they're doing, but I don't really explain it. Um, right, so right. it's kind of some of it's in my head. I, I've been. I've been intending to go through and put in. I've got a few lore notes littered around, but they don't go very far into what's, what's really going on. Yeah. Um, but the lore I notes intend- are good. For I can't look, but I don't find any. There's a few. There's there's one actually that's right there at the beginning of uh, the spawn point. That's right under the little sail. Oh. Right. Right next to where you spawn. There's one right there, and they kind of guide you. Each one of them tells you where the person who wrote the note was headed and why they were headed there. Um, but they only go so far right now, and they don't they don't get very far. Um, and I've been intending to go through and, and add more to them, but I've been busy adding dungeons, and then I made Isle of Women, and so I kind of got distracted, and it kind of fell by the wayside. But it, it's it's something I, I need to go back and... and flesh out a little bit more just because I think there's some people who, who take an interest in that stuff so I should I should go in uh, it down, but. now, now I think uh, I found by my castle there is also another place called the furnace of Acheron <gasps> yeah and I cleared that out but you can't get into that door because it's locked you need a key or something you, you well is that a back don't. entrance into the volcano 
No, you don't need a key, but I will say the thing that you need to get in there is kind of the clue is the clue is the fact of what's going on right there at the entrance and the way everything looks. Gotcha. Okay. Wow. Oh, so you it's a uh, requires some progression and I will say that once you get in there you you'll get your first taste of the riddle of steel mechanic. There's there's something in there that kind of gives you a clue as to the underlying mechanics of uncovering the riddle of steel. Um, essentially, you, you'll find a resource in there that you will have absolutely no use for, but you'll know it's a craftable, and it'll give you a clue of what what and possibly who you need in order to craft it. Um, I guess is is where you learn blood mortar or something for building. Right? I'll, you'll just have to find out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go play around there some more now. Yeah. So there there are. There's an under the underlying mechanic of the Riddle of Steel on the map is actually contained in special thralls. So all over the map, in various camps, there's a finite number of them. There are special thralls, some of which you'll know immediately once you put them on the wheel because they're they're um, red. They're outlined. Yeah, they're red. red. Yes, yeah. and and they do special stuff. Um, you may not know immediately what they do. Um, some of them take a little trial and error of various things. Um, but you, you, they, there are special ones. Now, not all of them are red. Um, that was brought to my attention. It's something I need to look at each individual one and make sure that they're all red. I, some of them I didn't intend to be red. I intended to be a different color. Um, because because there's, a, there's a riddle of steel branch of thralls, and then there's also a, a cannibal branch. And there's a there's a little bit of overlap between the two, but they have different endpoints. Um, so, and then the Riddle of Steel itself, there's there's a mechanic that I need to add some other stuff to. There's some people been asking me. They're like, "Hey, when are you going to add more to this?" And I was like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's on the it's on the to do list." Right, right. But the, you know, Isle of Men. Isle of Men is is. I'm I am not going to quit updating it anytime soon. I've been working on it for a couple of years. I, I don't you got I think you guys picked it up right after I did one of the more recent updates because did you I don't think you saw it even when I had done the new landscaping because recently the volcano actually has volcano rock now and it didn't. Oh, uh, and, oh, okay. Yeah, it, it didn't because the the landscape of the jungle. Um, I had to learn. I had to figure out how to integrate lava rock, and I'm my own teacher on a lot of this stuff. So I just had to figure that out on my own. Um, and I figured out how to do that, and so I went back and did a decorative pass on the map. And also, like when you're walking around on the paths and stuff like that, originally those paths were just bare paths. They didn't have the flagstones. Oh, right. oh, okay. Yeah. And, and all the all the lava stones that are up the sides of the mountains, that's all relatively new. Um, I actually the the next update I'm working on has some additional visual changes to the island um, for for theme purposes. So there's going to be more um, more cannibal references throughout the map. You'll see certain path decorations and stuff like that crop up you'll see some changes to i intend to make some changes to the storm but i don't know how far i'm going to get with that because i want to do some other stuff with the storm um i will notch down the volume just a hair i'll do you a solid on that one okay yeah everybody's been going on about the volume of the storm like it completely drowns out we can't even hear other people talk and chat so yeah so i I, I I have this, you know, I have to get feedback from people on some of this stuff like that because when I'm playing and testing, you know, I I have it set the way I have it set. And so I, I try to pay attention to how loud some stuff is, but, you know, I'm, I'm not ever playing and hearing it go over people's mics and stuff like that whenever I hear it. So I kind of, that's why I've, I've been... Oh, I've been, we had a new person like last night, I guess, joined the server, and a storm was going on. Oh yeah, and was you there I, when he? I, I caught it on re. I caught it on replay, and I know. Uh -oh. I've been watching the streams because I find I find this very 
very informative because I'm yeah. watching how you play. Because you know my friends play, but we we've, we've been playing together for a long time, so we kind of right. we have a, a rhythm. Yeah, um, know how so, they play. Yeah, so I, I don't know how. So watching you guys play is very important. So you know there's certain things. Where I'm That's where the local client hardware um, can have, could possibly oh. have a little bit of trouble. The oh, server, I don't have any server itself, with that. yeah, it's going to come down to hardware. It's going to come down to graphics card slash, um, <laughs> I mean, mostly graphics card. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> because it, it doesn't, the server doesn't compute that. The server just computes the path. And right. then all of, all of the visuals are computed on, on your local client side. Hold on, Darth. So, we got somebody so chatting. It's one of those things. Give me, give it a second. Oh, um, yeah. I can't pronounce it. It's MJ. I guess uh, MJ. Uh, she yeah, or he says right. the the irony of the storm drowning yeah, out he. Darth, <laughs> and he's laughing. Then he says, "I uh, play the Isle of Man on Darth's server, <laughs> and the storm isn't that loud, but I do turn down the audio." Which I see you doing now. Yeah, I was turning it down. I had turned it down before. And <laughs> I didn't think it was, you know. Everyone's like, oh, it's so loud. It's like, I'm like, well, I turned down my audio. I don't know. Why can't you guys turn it down? And then all of a sudden I got hit with this one. I'm like, what the hell? That is a night and day. I'm going to have to turn down my audio again. Okay. I'll do a balance pass on that. <laughs> Jeez. I'll get I'll, I'll I'll get it in on the next update. <laughs> nice. See, this is all user yeah. feedback. <laughs> I don't want to hurt you, but I will. These elephants are. Okay, so now let, let me ask. 
she mentioned that uh, you were offering to uh, move her server to your dedicated server. Yes, I've got space, yes. Awesome! So you're... But we haven't I really mean, uh, announced that right... yet, Jake. You're kind of jumping the gun oh. and the cat out of the bag. Oh, sorry. All right. I'll zip it. <laughs> <laughs> well, the cat's I'll out of the bag it. now. Let's, let's finish it. Later. I... So... <laughs> Yeah, so, so the reason being is I, I notice you sometimes have connectivity issues. Yeah. And you're in my map, and, and quite frankly, um, when I had the alternate music that was causing a problem, um, I was actually, I'll, I'll use the word touch, yeah. Yeah. that despite the fact that you were getting demonetized, um, when it was playing, you were still playing. Oh yeah. So, you know, I I I have a really good server. I maintain it. Um, it's got pretty good hardware in it. Um, it's what I do all my testing on because I want to see things run smooth. I've got the space. That's why I was um, telling her is like because I, I was telling her like you probably got the memory maxed out and everything. It's not maxed out like my dev kit machine is maxed out, but uh -huh. it's got... Probably a lot better than what she gets out of G Portal, I'm sure. I've got, let's see, um, I can run four servers simultaneously at, um, I've probably got 16 gigs of RAM per that I could run on a I server, and most that. servers only need but like eight after they've loaded up with mod. Ah! So there won't be any problem, and it's fully loaded with Gen 4 NVMEs. It's got, it's got a 4.27 gigahertz processor, which lets me run it at 60 frames. So uh, it, it'll it'll feel like so by comparison. Yeah. Um, and I do all of my math right now, so I know how the map runs on that server. If it's running clunky on that server, I fine tune it. Um, so just you know. So that 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 little bit of an issue goes away. Um, I've got I've got the resources. Well, um, I I found the factory. My... A feast. Yes, the factory. Oh uh oh. Those are Yagai. Yeah. And you're able to kill Yagais now. You should you should go back to that. Uh, <laughs> oh God! Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh. I, I so want to see that. I've and never seen. I've never seen someone die in demigod mode before. <laughs> hey, I know. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, they they one shot me there in demigod mode. I was just like, "What the f?" But oh, yeah, there's some dead named there. I know. Oh. There's nothing I can do about it. It's either him or me. Skin Weaver mm -hmm. Graph. Yeah. Oh, there is actually very near where you live. If you head out to the east, there is actually a Yagai temple that has some pretty what, cool special love Yag? Yes. I think yes. I uh, discovered and... that temple. Um, oh, you did. Isn't that where I got one shot of as a demigod? I don't think so. That's that's the. Uh, I think that's a different spot. The the. The bloody temple of Yog has. Uh, I want that axe. You walk when you. Look at yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that, again, that's the remnants of the giants that the gods struck down on the island. Okay, can right? I have that axe? So that, I want that axe. <laughs> that's pure, you, you might have problems with your encumbrance, but. Oh uh, well, hey, I got unlimited encumbrance now. Come on now. Not that, uh, not that unlimited. Sorry. <laughs> You're not even in demigod mode. Come yeah, actually, on. Up, up in the up in the trees in a lot of places, there's actually discarded weapons and dropped weapons and stuff like that. Oh, up in the um, trees. From from <laughs> trees. yeah, up in the trees. So never 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 forget to look up every once in a while. There's there's stuff up that you might miss. Oh, um, awesome. well, you know. Now I got to remember climb every this, single freaking tree. Because remember, this the island, part of the design I go for on this island is vertical. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. So, that hurt. 
I go and you notice this when you were going down and down and down and down in the volcano. I make I try to make maximum usage of not just the horizontal space but the vertical. And so I I want what I'm going for is a full 3D top to bottom. You can build up in the trees, adventure down on the ground, adventure under the ground. It's all over. You know, I want to make absolute maximum use of the space um, so that the player feels extra small. <laughs> I want the extra small. I want the, the map to the map is the key enemy in this for the player because of distance, because of scale, because of potential of falling to your death if you're not careful. Yeah. Um, all the temperature system that I put in and things like that. Like the the, the map itself is, is your biggest enemy. Um, so that you know, I, I try to amp that up every chance I get. I'm getting a commercial now. It's a shock to the system. Well, you know, the, uh, I got to make my money somehow, I guess. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> <sighs> but the, uh, yeah, let's see. I, I, uh, you probably haven't found <clears throat> the Witch Queen yet. She's out there. She's a little bit modified. I need to go back and touch her again. Um, okay, she'd be in the Marion area, right? She's not. I mean, she really? isn't. A, she there's kind of two Lemurian areas. Oh. Um, one one is yeah. the easygoing Lemurians. You just you can learn the Durketto religion there. Um, but the other the other area is kind of the sunken city yeah. equivalent, where it's those kinds of creatures and then the, the witch queen is with them. Oh. So that I can carve it on your pile. So you're there. There's there's a place and it has a different vibe to it once you enter that kind of zone. And um, I'm I imagining an underwater entrance. Oh, of course. Oh, God. <laughs> there's there's uh, a little swimming. There's, uh, there's, stop uh, giving him ideas. <laughs> there's there's a couple of water caves. There's a, there's a couple of swim caves. Um, you just haven't found them yet. Yeah, I figured there was. I was going to go swimming. And... Yep, there's a couple of swim caves. <gasps> um, one of them I've, I was toying with I, I didn't spend the time on the animation to learn how to do the animations yet but Break on. one of them is going to have shark um sorry great whites that are off the off the coast they're they're going to come alive at some point um no! so swimming off the coast will have its own dangers somebody wants to shoot me in the butt then he's laughing about it school. no no shooting me in the butt i might enjoy it Stop that. It's three cotton studios saying that. Shooter in the butt, he says. Okay, let's just down here. Is this a cave? Is yeah. this a cave? Yeah, you're headed. So there. Uh, did I find what you're... There is a cave down there. It's not a very big cave, but there is a cave down there. Hmm. This, this is more of a path through. So this is kind of a separating region kind of area. Uh, okay, um, so so basically it's kind of a you know, hidden base location possible. You know, it, put, it, put your staff... Some of this stuff I intentionally put... Yeah. If if it was a I've PvP been curious server, if everybody, yeah, you'd be able to put your if it was PvP staff. server. Yeah. I I've been curious if anybody uses the map for PvP because I, I don't play PvP. Um, but I always try like on this map in particular when I was making it, I was thinking, name. okay, density so of trees, blocking I don't know, if trebuchets became particularly useful, I don't know if they really are or not in PvP, right. but if they became after a change from Funcom particularly useful for it, it would be really hard to use them in the jungle. And people could build up in trees and it might be hard to spot each other. I you know, I don't get into their mind very well. Um, but um, but that, to me, even though I don't play PvP, I always felt like it's Conan should have a strong PvP component.
um, just by the nature of what it is. And so I, I think about it when I'm doing um, stuff on this map and on another one I'm working on, um, and actually another one I'm working on, but you know, Isle of Women has nothing to do with it. You know, that's just casual, casual play time. Um, but the uh, Isle of Men, I, I was thinking about that and placing various hidey holes and things like that. Like you'll find trees where the root system is hollowed out. So you could build a base under the root system. There's quite a few of those scattered around that are kind of hidden. Right. Um, and also, that's another reason why I wanted the map to be as big as possible was because if I get it as big as possible, then it's the, it's hardest to track people down. It's hardest to track down if somebody puts a stash base or something like that where they can hide their stuff. Um, so, you know, I, I, I'm attempting it. it. It may not be what they're looking for, but I think a lot of PvP players, maybe they all want something else. I, I'm not really sure, but I tried. Right. Um, well, there's been a lot of interest uh, for PvP players. Uh, I had a, a guy come up to me today, actually, uh, wanting to join in to the server, and uh, but he was uh, he thought it was a PvP, and I'm like, oh no, it's not PvP. I'm so sorry. And then he's like, um, well, do you have PvP yeah. servers? And I'm like, oh no, no, I'm so sorry. No, I don't. Oh hell no, I don't. Like not just no, but oh hell no, I don't do PvP. I'm a horrible fighter, and worse yet, holy moly, I got him your name so that I can carve it on your eye. damn wolves! You picked the wrong fight. Oh, see? Whenever I'm I would back. love, I would love to. Uh oh. PvP to me, I, I would love to, to want to play it. I just personally, I, I don't have the the motivation. Um, simply because Conan for me is you kind of balance your stress, right? <laughs> like you you you, you want to go fight, you can go fight. You want to build your base, you build your base. Yeah. You know, and and PvP is just stress, and some people like that. Um, right. Well, I, you know, I, I first started out in a PvP server, believe it or not, Raycon. Raycon's like calling me a chicken. Yeah, you come in here and tell that to my face, buddy. And come on. You know, ta <laughs> There you go. But, uh, yeah, uh, I used to be in a PvP server, and, uh, and I was like one of, the, you know, I'm a mother hen, and I, I, I'm a harvester. <laughs> And I guess yeah. people knew that. I and, that. and I, I was just like, I was just like, you know, I'll give you everything. Here, take it, you know. I actually put out chests full of stuff so that people would leave me alone and you could just like, have my chests, you know. What? And it worked. When people find out you're a hoarder, they put a target on your head and it's like, she's got, yeah, she probably well, got one. Well, I mean, it worked for the most part. Raider. And then one day oh, I come but log she's, in and she's, find everything. If she's working for them, then <laughs> you don't want to. Yeah. You don't want to. I, I was, I was like unaffiliated. <laughs> and then, uh, then one day somebody, yeah, I, I log in and, and somebody had totally demolished my base and, and then some. <laughs> Riney, Riney, why aren't you in here? <laughs> we almost got everybody back. We might be able to go to the volcano if we can get Riney back in. Because we have Jay, we have uh, Betrayed, and we have Riney and myself. Are we missing anybody other than that? They're all lurking. Silent Fairy. Oh, here. Silent Fairy. He, yeah, we're he missing. Him. Missing. Yeah. Uh, more like a hoarder, but uh, then again, who isn't in this game, right? Yeah, that's damn right. It's damn right, Riney. And then uh, she's like, uh, "Hey, hey, don't agree with Recon. Come on now. I'm not a chicken, Riney." <laughs> yeah, at least yeah, I go and do, and do stuff and things. Uh, it's 
and she's coming in. She's probably already here, if mm. I heard that correctly. In the middle of a dungeon in the volcano, and you climb up the wall to hide from one little enemy. Okay, hold on. Out in the middle of the night, I'm gonna have my nightly visitor soon. Ah, so, um, one thing I will, um, I'll give you a, a warning about something that's coming. Uh oh. Um, I don't know if you saw that moment, temporarily I had fog of war enabled on the map, and I had a problem with it, so I turned it back off. Um, oh, no. but it, it, but it, it is coming back. It's just I got to work out some kinks with persistence on it through uh, relog attempts and stuff like that. It was not only was it showing up whenever people use multiple maps together, which is its own problem. Um, the fog, what the clearing of the fog wasn't persisting across um, server restart. And so every time the server would restart or the mod would reload, it would completely wipe it out again. Um, I, I am working on the fix for that, and when I get that fixed, it's going to come back. Um, and, it, you know, it'll so, show you so where you... Fog, it, so the Fog of War is designed to wipe out your base? So, no, 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 no. Just hides when you the map. The, it hides the map until you discover the area. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Now, it, it has... It, it, it does two things. <laughs> One is it... One is it obscures the map, which is its own benefit to me personally because it makes some people miserable. But the the benefit to it is... It makes you go explore. It, it, it will tell you where you haven't been. Right, and right. so a lot of people will... You know, when people play the game, what I've noticed is they, they have their root. And they stick to their root because they know it, they know what's on it, and they don't go off of that. And they, and they miss stuff. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Um, like so a you... gigantic pit to hell out there. Oh! What was that? <laughs> There's a giant ass pit to hell that I found over here. Oh, I know where you are. You can't see the bottom. <laughs> what? Oh, oh God. my God. I think Should you're I at what's think called the uh, watery, watery grave. Yeah, I see some big rib bones, and then, yeah, that's about Water all I can see. Waterfalls. I hear the waterfalls. Yeah, you're at the watery grave. That's actually a secondary um, meteor point. Oh, so I see the, the yeah, meteors come down there. There's oh. just not as many. It's a, a lot hit the top of the volcano. So, like, when you're... When you're wanting to get lots of star metal, top of the volcano, that's the best place to go. But that watery grave, um, occasionally they come raining down. Now, be advised that you may get hit with a meteor while you're in there. And oh, so that won't there's be a my real risk time. that you'll get. <laughs> I've been hit by, I, I got one shotted by a meteor once, guys, on the base game Conan. Believe it or not. What did I? <laughs> yeah. Yep. It's it's an insta kill, but they they do yep. go down there, and it's not very many, but there there's a way, and there there is a dungeon attached to that. There's actually a there's a point of interest on the way to there too. Um, that <laughs> has a recipe. It has at least one recipe. It has a couple of uh, has a couple of three school bosses that drop some potentially good stuff. Um, and then kind of has some other features to it. Um, but, uh, and then down in the, down at the watery grave, there's a, there's a dungeon attached to that. Oh, and the other thing that, um, you guys started playing since I did these improvements, I believe, um, because you, when you were down in the cave last night and where mm -hmm. you were about to head in a little while, um, those caves actually just got complete reworks in terms of the way they're textured. Anybody who started playing the game a year and a half ago, um, those caves were very plain. The walls were quite smooth. Um, but leading into Chapter 4, I actually went through and bumped out all the walls, made them look more base game cavey, added all the resources and stuff like that. That's a relatively new addition. 
But most, most people who played early, it didn't look like that. Um, and I went, I went through and I touched almost every cave to give them all more texture. Oh, okay, um, okay. Uh, and you're in the, yeah, the you're in the Jill area right now. It, I'm not really satisfied with the way it, it is right now. I'm going to go through and add some more interesting things in this area. Oh, okay. um, I needed the Jills on the map just so that people could get black blood and the tools yeah, and stuff yeah. like that. Oh, uh, well, yeah, it's... we got a lot of that black blood uh, at the volcano the other night. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's a there's a there's a few um, the, the Jill vol towards the volcano as well. Right. Yeah, I was uh, harvesting up them up, and I noticed there was a lot of black blood that we were getting out of them. Ooh. Whoa. I swam all the way to this big, huge cove at the bottom part of the island. Oh, uh, yeah. We're getting lizards oh. everywhere. You're still yeah, down there. A, yeah, yeah. And there is some big altar thingy with a, with a freaking huge skull on it. And underneath the water is like, like arches. And you swim under it or whatever. But hey, you know what else I'm going to need if I'm going to do that, right? <laughs> You're going to want buddies. Uh, no, I'm actually going to want my alligator masks from the Extreme Exiles. Oh, that's the, that's the frog head my, ga thing. my gator mask. Yep, I need uh, my gator mask. So, Jupe, <laughs> but okay. Jupe, who's listening, is laughing his ass off right now because that mask, that mask is banned on my servers, the fish head mask. Oh. It's like, I, I, Cybercat. Cybercat's cool, but the fish head mask is just too much for me. I, I can handle all the other banner of perverted thing that's in Exile's Extreme, but not the fish head mask. I draw the line at fish head. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> he's he's mad because I quit carrying that just so I didn't have to see his stupid fish head running around on my map while I was playing. Hey, and is an alligator mask just as ugly? Yeah, well, I, they, if they switched it to an alligator, maybe I'm not as offended anymore. But the fish no. head. Yeah, j j just just give me my Exiles stream uh, thing, and I'll oh. make my gator mask. And then, God. and then you can be the judge. And then you can then you can be the judge. You can tell me whether it's ugly as crap. No, and I get rid of it or not. The absurdity of the fish head was just it, it's just oh, too much. Oh God, yeah. <laughs> oh. This has a couple of uh, lots of crates. Oh yeah, it does. Yeah, there's some there's some good free loot that hangs out near that. Uh, I forget what I named it. Um, uh, he Trevor? probably likes yeah, to yeah, uh, torture me and ruin my fun. That is uh, from uh, MJ. Said that. By the way. And I did yeah. get a couple of whales. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I, I, I did few... find a couple whales down here. Looks like I am. Where am I? Where am? Oh, I don't know how I ended up all the way over here on the uh, east side at the beach. Oh. But I did. Okay. Oh wow! Altist dancer, who's that? Oh, ha ha! You can't, can't get me. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I, uh, is that a statue? Oh no, statue no, it's the little deep, uh, deep thing. And I'm thinking, oh yay! I found something. A little, well, well, I did. I found a little pool. Oh, great, great, a little marine statue. Uh, I'm not getting that. Forget it. I can't get it. <laughs> uh, is that a? Yes. Is that a phantom island over that way? <laughs> yeah, it's just, it's just a, yeah, that's outside the play area. Okay. Ooh, look! Now, I was, I was, I was look at all that brimstone! Oh my ever, god! Once we get a Kona Exiles 2, I'll be using all 25 by 25 if we ever get Kona Exiles 2 on uh, Unreal 5. I will make a map that uses the entire thing. Isle of Men will be reborn. Oh. Oh, nice! Hey, I, I've actually, I've actually played on a server where there was no. There was no what? Green, green fence of death. 
Oh yeah, I yeah, mine doesn't have mine doesn't kill you. I think it just I think I have a I think I just have a stop wall out there. Um, if you go outside, so I found this out when I was there. When I first started making this map, I had no idea what I was doing. Like I had never no. touched Unreal. Um, and the, actually, the the volcano was about two times taller than what you see. Um, but the problem was, is it, it extended above the physics limit. So everybody knows in general that the map is contained eight by eight kilometers right. um, in the horizontal, but there's actually a vertical physics limit as well. Oh. And the way the map is today, the sea level is the absolute bottom and the top of the volcano is chopped right at the absolute top. So if you climb up on the walls that kind of border the top of the volcano, you'll actually note that your thralls may behave kind of strange up there um, because it, it doesn't, the physics starts to go kind of wonky. And what, if, if the way I noticed it was beyond the physics limit when you knock down an npc they'll bounce through the ground and yeah, then eventually the floor. yeah they and when you kill them they just disappear through the ground mm -hmm. and so that it's uh you can you can do certain things outside the physics limit but as far as general play goes um it, it people will see it and, and it's unsightly and they'll complain that hey i can't kill this guy and loot his body and it's behaving weird because it just doesn't support it out there and it also starts um for this map it wouldn't be such a big deal but for others it would be once you get outside the physics limit it starts raining um and the uh actually the the rain blocker from roots actually fails near the physics limit and so, so that's why there's a a detail that only I would notice, which is it doesn't rain at sea level on the map because there is there is just a short distance above the shoreline where if I had it rain at that level, the um, scene capture that it does for the rain doesn't work. So that's why the rain only starts part way up the up the volcano up the shoreline. Um, just well, so that I people don't have the, yeah, I noticed that in the, our base it rains constantly inside the base. So does that mean um, our some of that some of that depend no, your base is up high enough. Um, depending on how you have your base closed or unclosed and whether or not you have windows you can get rain inside the base still too. It happens, so the way it, the method by which it cancels rain is there is an image that's taken from the vertical down and it does a mask kind of thing on the rooftop and then screens out the, the effect. Um, so I think they, I think in a recent patch they may have finally fixed storm glass. Storm glass was the classic problem because the storm glass roof pieces have that semi-transparent glass in them. And so when the image would come down, it was still able to image within the base. It would still rain within the base. I think that got fixed, though. And I'm not sure how they fixed it because of the way that works. But if there are gaps in bases and things like that, again, it breaks down and you'll get rain in your base. I'm a oh. cultist bay, and there are some huge, ugly, corrupt-looking crystal oh, servers here. Yeah. Oh yeah, so weird. Can't wait to tell you to go down to the water. Jungle giant. Shh. <laughs> I can carve it on your fire, me, dude. <laughs> uh, just uh, just lure her by the edge and push her like. What? People with elevators. <laughs> Uh, 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 it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna do this. There we go. Thank God I can climb the side of the ship. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just wait. I'll just wait until daylight. Well, he's got some range on his claws, doesn't he? Well, it, it's not. It's, I'm displaced. Uh, things are, you know, I see them as farther away when they're actually right in my face. 
Yeah. And that's just part of the uh, um, problem side. Oh, you're, having. you're all the way up to. You're all the way up to level fifty-eight already. Me? On the on the battle pass, yeah, that's what just popped up. Oh yeah. I already completed the battle pass. Yeah, you're cranking through that battle pass. Uh, I'm not doing anything though. I'm yeah, just like I can't, I can't even start it. I, they they change the way that you gain um, battle pass experience. Yeah, it's all passive now. Yeah, it's all passive. So when you're now you're just by doing what you're doing, you've progressed all the way through level fifty eight already. That's actually quite impressive. Yeah. Oh. Um, and when you kill like rabbits and stuff, you're getting a little tiny bit of experience for the battle pass. All yeah. right, it's all right. It's daytime, and that guy's still. Oh, good. He just just. One of the downsides to uh, making maps is that I don't get to play very much. So if I want if I want the battle pass, I just have to, I buy my way through it, which I don't begrudge. Right. But I I. I, I know, it's like, I, I spend all my time with death kit, but I want to do my part, so I go ahead and skip my, get myself through the battle pass right off the bat, but it, it's kind of impressive, because chapter hasn't been out very long, and you're almost already done with the battle pass. See what's up these, this huge flight of stairs. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm, I, I'm gonna I might die here, guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I changed, those jungle giants, I was like, well, you know, the regular frost giants give you cold snap, so I have these guys give you sweltering heat. Yeah, but yeah, that's usually, that, that usually is countered now. with, uh, you know, with spice, something spicy, but in this case, I was uh, eating ice, and I was, like, downing ice, and I was still getting damage. It was not countering. Oh, yeah, it's, it, it's, it, it's pretty because it, it, you're working against the environment too right like the, the map's really hot and stuff like that so the cooling yeah. down i'm not sure you can that cooling down um you gotta have well, that was it. cooling down but when i was under heat stroke it was not even doing anything usually in the base game oh yeah you could cool yourself down to at least the next level to like extremely With you know snap? extremely heat or something I, I, but not this case I believe all I did was flip the flip from hot from cold to hot. I, I would I I'm not sure. I, I'd have to go back and check. I always thought cold snap there was a delay where there was nothing you could do about it. And then it would it eased off, but I'm not sure. Um, um but I'm pretty sure all I all I did for that one was flip the flip it from from uh, cold to hot. Yeah, well the next time I'm in the base Good. game Conan, I'll show you. Um, yeah. you know, I'll I'll go battle a giant with the cold snap and show you. Uh, I'll I'll yeah. make like a five I, minute. I can take a look at it too. Yeah, five it's minute little here. video to you know send it off to you, so this way you'll see. Yeah. Uh, but. Uh, oh. Yeah. Well, I can do. I can also. I can also pull open the blueprints and take a look at at what I changed and what possibly might if there's something different. Oh, this is a nice little, nice little cove of cheddar oh. here with iron ore and brimstone. Um, this, remember the husks. This is right over husks here. Up here. There's husks up here. Oh, is that island swimmable? Can I swim to that island over there? <gasps> those are all. Those are all off Ghost. map. Uh, Purely right. decorative. The body is the island for you. Island. Yeah. I have to. Make sure you're checking those beaches for dead whales. I have been. Oh, yeah. well, that's... I got three already. I'm not seeing any. Oh, there's one. Where? There's one in frame. Turn right. Yeah. Oh. There you go. Uh, which is best? Pick the cleaver. Oh, there's two of them. All right, so pickaxe or uh, meat cleaver? Cleaver. Or cleaver, actual cleaver. I, I tried using a cleaver earlier and it didn't work. It's your pickaxe or axe. Okay. I'll have to take a look at it. All right, well, I got a, I got a star metal meat cleaver. Let me try that on this one. Okay. Yeah. It's not working with star metal at all. Say, I'm, 
Yeah, I was gonna say I'll de I'll defer on the I'll have to take a look. The way tools are set up. Let, let me uh try with the axe before I try with the uh Yeah. Axe would be better for meat wise. Hold on. Where's my uh Am I missing here I Crap, I think this is a dungeon. Oh, yeah. Not, I don't think I'm going to be there going in here. <laughs> yeah. Yikes. Ooh. Oh, that just totally disintegrated. Ew. I'm, I, I'm all scared. I don't want to go. <laughs> what I go? Oh, chicky. Come on now. Notice the detail I left. Yeah, the I noticed part. that. <laughs> <laughs> Black oh, oh, that's awesome. We can totally die here, Ryan. <laughs> you can do it, Ryan. -y. We got faith in you. I always feel like I'm missing stuff when I go through these temples that you have out. Now that's the reason why I'm on the beach, really. I was like, ooh, I can get whales. I'm putting a bedroll right here. Look at that. Yeah, I. I, I have a oh, I have a, a desire to have a whale hunt where the whales are actually swimming and you and you have to hunt them down kind of like Moby Dick so to speak where they oh. drag them to your whaling station on the beach. Now well, something I, tells me that is totally swimmable. Oh my god! <gasps> oh no 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 I, no! I'm totally no, swimming no, over no. there. Um. Elia, this thing that I'm in here right now, you won't want to do, man. Oh, yeah? Uh, your fear of heights would say, screw this! Ah, well, uh, the oh, there's even are. a ship right there! Ooh. Ooh. Do I oh. want to do this? Okay, I'm, like, uh... All right, that looks like that might be the island right there. So let's try it. Let's try it. Yeah, it's it's not a it's not a populatable island. It's a it's purely decorative. Oh damn! Yeah. Really? Yeah. I what? what uh, oh. Wow. Is he pretty on, even on the ship? The heck is this? Do you at least have? What do you want a rowboat? Around? You want a rowboat out there? This is like, oh wow, this is like. Uh... I was just gonna swim and see if there's at least flotsam I could get in the water. Being that there's a ship right there. Now the the <gasps> ship is just uh, the ship is to show you that the people are coming and going from the island. Oh yeah, it's moving. <laughs> This, this is kind of like that Ooh, harbor that it's drowned and twice drowned. Oh, what's the, the fish? This is the fish guys. This is, the, oh. this is like the harbor that drowned and twice drowned. Go in yeah, I know exactly where you are. Well, it takes you every time by one base, I think. Okay, looks like I could get up from right here. All right. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I gotta climb. Oh, it's an easy climb. Yeah. Okay. Got a cue on it. I got a cue on it. Oh. I found cannibals in the tree. Oh, I want. To, I want to. I want to go on that ship. Wow. Now, now the this the sequel to this map that I'm currently working on. That's called Escape from the Isle of Men. Uh -huh. Is is about two thirds water with really deep oceans, and the goal there is to have boats and boat travel and things like that. <laughs> Just what I was talking about earlier. Yeah. And but before I get that one done, sharks have to be finished for attacking. Oh no! Oh, oh nice. No. <laughs> there you go, Ronnie. There's your sharks. <laughs> I've got him. I've got him. Half oh, she's working. Gag she's just giggling like a dog. Okay. 
Oh, this uh, this, I'm this make dungeon you walk thing, plank. this dungeon thing has glowy goop and orange fricassins. Yeah, that place is a uh, is uh, murder on the eyes in some places. Oh, <laughs> it's, yeah. it's, oh one it's step very, back, uh, and they kill me. It's very 1980s neon in that dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> Pork chop! Quite a few good pigs there. Okay. Oh, this is the Dagon thingy. Uh. Oh, oh, don't don't go cause trouble here. Who's my. what I do? Oh, here it is. Just Gotta get my pork chops in and my exquisite sweets. There we go. You're supposed to live entirely on bacon and river water because the island would smell great if everyone just lived off of bacon and river water. <laughs> yeah. I jumped. I jumped down the hole this time. Alright, well, I think so I'm gonna I leave you to your death. I mean, to your good time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll nice. be talking to you through the streams, Darth. Thank you. Alright. Alright. Thanks for having me. Darth Fizz it does. That's everyone. Oh my god. This is the guy. Alright, have fun. Thank you very much. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Crap. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, guys. That's the fish guy that shouldn't be. I found some goodies. Oh, yeah? Oh, I'm not taking any damage. Really? What'd you mm -hmm. find? Barely taking any damage. You, that'd be cheating. Okay. All I could tell is visiting the. I'm kidding me. Depths I need a better, of hell, I need better weapon. Water wise. Mm -hmm. Is a good idea. So we're only uh, missing uh, elder queens at this point, right? So we can't, we still can't yeah. do the uh, volcano. Damn! Where's uh? I yes, oh, I can it's a Friday night. That's right. He's got to work. Oh, wow! I just... Heck, am I supposed that's to get this guy? Poor guy. Um, uh, where's that one guy? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. He's not alone. Oh, I, can, oh hi. I cannot get this guy. I think I'm gonna go around the other side and see what's down there. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna run through. I'm just gonna run through the next guys. Defeat demonic boars. Oh jeez, there's another guy. Oh, the fish dude. Just running through him. For the ah! All right, I've been defeating a ton of these demonic boars, and. I there it goes. I was gonna say, and oh. I only got crap for two. Oh. oh no! Oh no! You know that uh, statue of the that, that place with the the, the witch queen? Mm -hmm. you know, the statues kind of come to life. Well, <laughs> kind of like. what they have up here, except there's like three or four of them. <clears throat> I'm running past this too because I can't do those. Oh no! I can't do those guys. Big giant. Do you need help, Riney? God, they're all. Coming. Okay. Uh, it's okay. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just in this big old dungeon all by my little self, not being able to go any place. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh, okay. I'm in an elevator going down. Oh, that's kind of cool. Purple lights. There's an elevator. Uh oh. Oh 
Uh, oh, I meant to be Internet again. connection. Yeah, I was. Uh, it brought me back to the. Oh, okay. Pick up my bedroom here. At least I got to see where this was and what it consisted of. So, so while we're here, just uh, for those of you who uh, are watching in YouTube, uh, just make sure you press that like button if you haven't done so already. That'd be much appreciated. And if you, uh, you know, like, follow, subscribe, that'd be awesome, guys. And uh, that would definitely help out the channel here. a lot. Some more ads. Yeah, my uh, internet is boinked. Oh. Uh, um. Yeah, okay. It's still trying to connect. Okay. There we go. Okay. And this little path over here goes. Oh, there's fish dudes in the. Oh, okay. Fish dudes in the woods right over there. I see you, fish dudes. Oh, my God. Hi, Ray. Yeah, you're a fan. Nice. Hey, Ray. Thank you for being a fan. Much appreciate it. For students over there, it's a split. Uh oh, what uh -oh. plane runs? Attack! There it goes. Wow. Oh, no. That was a delayed <laughs> reaction. Nope. At least I'm getting more ice and black eyes. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Bug larvae. And you know what those that means? Oh, oh. <laughs> fish guys are oh those fish guys are fighting the bugs. Yes, good. Fight the bugs. Fight the bugs for me. <laughs> Fight the bugs for me, fish dudes. Right. <laughs> yeah, nice. Nice job. Woohoo! You get them. I climb. I had. I had to climb a tree. I'm acting like a nut, so they can't. You guys like to leave. Nice. Oh, jeez. One of these days, There's if I have the money things. and the knowledge or or the tech guy to do it, and if I had the internet for it and the computer, I would totally have like all five of our uh, screens up so people could see all five screens at once on a stream so they could see what <laughs> you guys are doing. Wouldn't that be awesome? Mm -hmm. Sounds very technical. Run, 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 run. I know, but you know, I know <laughs> it can be done. I've seen it happen before, but. Uh... Oh, my God. Oh, okay. All right. Oh. So I'm back. I'm back there. Okay. I don't want to go that way. I want to go this way. I want to head back into the uh, jungle. I'm going to see what I can find out here. I'm gonna try to see what I can find out here. This one.
there. Oh yeah, there's a Oh, oh shit, the little larvae are coming after so me. Hey, How do we know hey, dude. It's a guy hey buddy, what you so doing? Fun. You're a wa Ooh, you're the watcher above, aren't you? You're a one skull. Hey, yeah, you wanna you wanna kill these little things for me? Come on up, see, see, there they are. They're coming up. See, see, there they are. <laughs> Tell him, Riney. Killing, he's killing a couple. Are you ready? Uh, oh crap! He's gonna kill me. Oh, of course, he's a one skull. Oh, he off me. Oh, Riney. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> you. He was the, you hey, he's the watcher the above. Levels that you got the other day. Oh hey, at least I made it back home, huh? Oh well, yeah, that's true. Stuck on. Alright, I'm uh. Yeah, I'm, I'm like. Oh, there we go. Around and rubber banding around like crazy. Let me uh. Who's that? Oh, at least I got lots of blubber. Blubber, blubber, blubber. Yeah, but we're gonna like 338. Yeah. Uh, you, all, you could also cook that. You could also cook that up too. King of one sixteen. He said you can cook it up, but it yields more uh, resources if you fluid press it. Yeah. Okay. It's like a one to one ratio. Yeah, I think that's everybody. All right. All right. Very hot. Oh, more piggies. I'm pork chops. <sighs> He's ignoring me, which means I'm nowhere near him, right? Oh, when you grill it up, you also get oil from it. <laughs> you only get one thing of oil if you grill it up. If you put in fluid press, you get three things of oil. Don't want to cause trouble here. But as a food source, it's not. It's not a good I mean, food source, but it is better. a food. But you get oil from it, so you want to yeah. put it in your fluid press. Yeah. yeah. I've been smashing the seeds for oil. Wait, what? Smash seeds. Well, well, we do get it. Uh, when oh, there's yeah. a ton of fiber out here, we can, you know, seeds like crazy. That's not a problem, but better, uh, better source of oil is now is the uh, whale. Blubber, which I was able to get yeah, blubber. Out of those two ways. Yeah, at least I got down there. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. That was interesting, to say the least. Oh, come on. Come on, lady. It's getting close to night time, guys. Come combinating. 
shut the door. Uh oh, are those whites? Uh, I don't really have to shut the door. Uh, I do. I? I'm in a dead area, guys. Oh, oh Jesus! Oh, oh, uh oh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just aim aimlessly wandering around, getting lost. Mm -hmm. What am I talking about? I am totally lost. Am I blind? I'm, I'm. I gotta be blind. There it is. Yep. I was blind. Whoa! Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't ah. think so, buddy. Nice try. <laughs> yeah. He tried. He tried to get at me. There's a whole bunch of whites right here. Oh, is that a burnt tree? A bunch of burnt trees. I'm just rolling around because I don't know what's around me. And I'm so out of sync, it's not even funny. Okay. You guys are awfully quiet, or am I disconnected? No, no, we're here. Oh, okay. I mean, I just, I, I, I'd ran to get a drink, uh, fill my cup up with oh, ice okay. and my soda. But I'm back. Oh, welcome back. I'm black. 
back. Okay. In black. You back too? Everybody's back? I was like, it's so quiet. Uh, I'm back in red and black, maybe. <laughs> nice. Alright. Still quiet. Okay. Am I gonna discover this place? What is there a discovery? I know some places you don't actually dis have a discovery a point of interest. All right, so there are some dead trees here. Um, I kind of like, so I'm I like, kinda like that, that when you have the ingredients for something, everything that you can make is all mm -hmm. green, and the stuff that you can't is in red. Yeah. All right. all right, I just put the fact that there's undead here. Yep. There, well, there's a, you know, this guy. Right there. Dead. He's dead, Jim. He's dead. Dead, dead in scare. Dead as hell. What am I doing? Well, at least I kind of found the harbor of the twice drowned and drowned mm -hmm. dungeon. Mm -hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh, didn't he say this area is supposed to be the Sumerian area? Let me look to see where you're at. Yes, Sumerian okay. area. This looks a lot like the mounds of the dead. Well, mm -hmm. old mounds of the dead was the Sumerian area. Oh, yeah. There was a server that I could actually um, use a Sumerial mount uh, as a work base. That big, huge round building, you know? It's great for a work base. To eat and interact right here. Oh, forgotten clan banners. For the gods. All right. Well, I, I found where there's a forgotten clan banner right here, guys. I I don't know what this place is, but we got that here. The forgotten clan. This marines. Ooh, he's got star metal on him. Star metal. Star metal. Yeah, these are definitely Sumerians. Where's the archer at? It's always oh, he up there. We're up there. Oh, I see. I see him. I see him now. He's, he's right there. Or she. She is right there. Go. She's dead. She's dead. Got her. Where is she? Here she is. There we go. Mm. How do I get in there? I just the Dower Village. And it's Sumerian. Woo! Woo! 
No, 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 no. Holy mother. Ah! Oh, my, my people are going to absolutely die. I got to get them out of here. Run, 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 run away. Too many of them. There's too many of them for them all. call I nearly died and this poor guy he, he's only level nine he almost he, he's, he's hurt he's hurt a little bit just just, just a little a bit over. just a little just bit over. but the others the others seem to be fine but I wasn't risking it because it was like 30 to one in there mm -hmm. so yeah Maybe if I, like, do a couple at a time, might be able to do that. Let's see if I can't, like, lure them out a couple at a time. Which I seriously doubt, but, you know, it's better than not at all. What is this? Is this anything? No. They're coming. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're coming. But as long as it's just one of you. Yeah. Oh, you're still hurt. <laughs> My people still hurt you. Tribe Chieftain. He had a legendary on him. Got some Sumerian d dinners. That's nice. Okay, well that was a, a fair amount of people. Oh god, oh god. Get me out of here. Oh god, oh god, oh, I'm dead. No! I died! There was too many of them, they had me pinned, I couldn't get out. Tried even, I tried to do my dodge and then I couldn't even dodge. I was just like, no! Oh no, all right. I'm gonna be all the way at the volcano, guys. Yep, yeah, I'm at the volcano. Huh. It was good while it lasted. Well, um, you guys want to come to the volcano and level up a few? I'm right next to the. Uh, oh, oh shit. Oh shit! I get. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I killed it by myself. Nice. Uh, I have my nightly visitor. Okay. Watch out for those nightly visitors. <laughs> oh boy. These guys are going to kill me over and over and over again, aren't they? Yeah. Okay. No! 
too many, too many. No, oh my God, oh my God, it's too many of you. No, you're only supposed to be one or two. All right, two, I can handle two. Nice. Are they fighting each other? Really? Not fighting each other, idiots. I can't believe they were fighting each other. Okay. Hi. Okay, there's that one. Yeah, every time you kill one of these, uh, you level up, and every time you harvest one of these, you level up. So you level up twice for one guy. This is how we got our levels this high so fast, is by killing these guys. Look at that. So twice with one, with one. And I got two attributes, so I'll just go to one and one there. There we go. Is there any more of these guys over here? No? Okay. Let's see if I can... There we go. Did you say you're at the golems? Yeah, I'm at the golems. Well, that's where my bedroll is, so when I died, I spawned here. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna Hold on, I'm not safe. I'm not safe. Oh, come on. <coughs> They keep coming at me. All right. Let me uh, move back a little bit. All right. I'm safe now. Anybody else want to join me here at the golems? I'll see what it's like. Uh, you want to level, your, level yourself up? Sure. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. There we go. There you go, sweetie. Betrayed, do you want to come? Yeah. He's explored. I've got my hey. steel quarter staff. Yeah, I don't know how to do this. And... Okay. I'm upgrading armor. Should I bring you some thralls hey. to level up? My thralls are all the way back at the Sumerian place. Forever again. Yeah. Well, they'll go, they'll return home one day after. Yeah, uh, that's what I'm gonna wait for. I'm gonna wait till they return home. Get it, get it, let, 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 let. Yeah, righty. Get a hit in. There we go. Do you want any mine? No, 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 no. no. I, you, I got uh, the obsidian one. Make sure you one. get a hit on golems. Yeah, make sure you get a hit on golems. That gives you another level as well. Yeah, everybody get a hit in, and then I'll finalize it. No, I'm saying for her, uh, she can get another level by using the pickaxe on the Oh, okay, golems. okay. Yeah, I see what you mean. Oh, all right. Oh, 
Get it in, Riney. Did you get a hit in? Here we go. You gained a few levels, I bet. Now, mind that real quick. Ooh, Riney, you gotta heal. Yeah. Alright, let, let's just let this guy simmer for a little bit till she heals. Yeah. Hurry up and get your head in, Ryan. My grandmother died. Okay, well, no, I didn't get a hit in on, on that one. Well, mind that, you'll still get, we'll get this one. Here comes the other one. Okay. Oh yeah, definitely uh, smack on these. Um, Rims yeah. Oh, one's coming for you. Got two coming for me. Hi guys. <laughs> I so love the axe. <laughs> Which axe you got? Uh, I just got a star metal one-handed axe. Because if I get a, in a crowd, I can just wheel down a crowd. I may have a legendary one-handed somewhere. Let me look. Bunch of iron stone. All right, now I got full vitality. Now I got to work on uh, the remainder of this frame. Okay. Okay. Since you have all your throws, I'm not doing that. Yeah, I, I just, you know, now I'm at level two hundred. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna come with my uh, dancers to get my dancers up. Nice. Okay. May have to wait. I think uh, we pretty much. Uh, Did you clear them all out? Yeah. Sort of clean them out a little bit. Yeah, I got you a one handed axe if you want it. Oh, I thought that was Brimson. Oh, cool. Yeah, nice. Lag spikes. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let me, uh... The heat. The heat. That time of day. It looks like, uh... I was about to get dropped. So, I just... Went out, and now I'm coming back in. Alright, we're gonna... This is so cool looking. The volcano. Uh, go go to Jake because I'm currently out of the server right now. Uh. 
I'll bring my rookies. Bunches of ironstone, man. I'm trying to blow up this uh, performers a little bit. All I need one golf, just one. Hey, what if they came up with like, like a? I was thinking about this, like, they use star metal to make building pieces, so they would be the same color as the star metal, you know? Like that, the, of course. Well, yeah, I they think the pretty you got stuff. something like that for crafting a like granite or something in this. It'd be the blue color, like. Uh, but I don't know what color it's going to be. But I think the star metal is part of the recipe for the granite, maybe, or something. Or maybe blood red building, because there's supposedly the, like the stone consolidant. There's no huh? stone consolidant that he has that's made out of blood. Oh, Or something like that. Yeah, kind of weird. So where are you guys at? You're running around by us. See how uh, look. See how I pull oh, the okay. torch. I headed down the thing. I don't want to pull out my. I don't want to keep my torch out because I keep was getting heat stroke from having it out. And I won't. I won't pull mine out then. It's harvesting ironstone. <laughs> Uh, mine just says entertained. I'm being entertained. Oh yeah, I thought I got both my entertainers here. Hmm. I just want to take out like one golem to level them up. Uh, I don't have to worry about uh, you know corruption right now. That's for certain. Yeah, because they they cleared it out. Just have to. I forgot the big... Oh, oh, great! Uh, you know those uh, the nighttime guys are down yep, here they, too. Yep, they're down here. <laughs> There's a nice big rock I can climb up. Oh, oh there's another one. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can kick him with my core staff. Hmm. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where are you, Ryan? Oh, I'm uh, I'm I'm in here. You're in I'm in the, I'm in I'm in the I'm in the field of crystal was harvesting ironstone. I see a Tyler. Hi. I got I got my torch going. Oh uh, well, we don't see you. I don't see you. I see somebody. And, and I'm jumping up and down too. We still don't see you. She's right, around the. She's right, around the yeah, corner. Yeah, I'm around the corner in that in that big field of crystal. Yeah, there you are. Yay. She's over here. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Yeah, that's me. I found my armor. Matic. For the uh, dragon bone. Mm-hmm. Nice. Where'd you find that at? I gotta go get that. <laughs> Was it in that hole? I can confirm nor deny that statement. Ah! Uh. Talia's gonna shit whichever she goes down there. Cause it's a narrow little path all the way down to the bottom. Oh god. Oh. Hey, yeah. Let's go. Let's, right, let's for those of you don't know, I got a very serious case of, you know, fear of heights. So when I play games that actually trigger that, you know, anxiety of fear of heights, it's very, it's very, um, yeah. Yeah. And, oh, and not to mention. Uh, a lot of the places fight. in Conan, I just won't go because it does trigger my fear of heights. Like the mountain climbing, uh, that one, or in Age of Calamitous, there's the you know inside the 
you know, that cave of death that we go to. And we have to climb that uh. big thing to the sea. Yeah, that one. That triggers my fear of heights is up there. Even though we're yeah, in the cave. I'm a little scared you gotta fight skeleton on the way down. So just add a heads up on that. There's the coal down here too. Well, coal is not what I need. I need some coal. I need to. Now, I noticed the pork chops. The salted pork chops is no longer giving me a strength bonus. Oh, really? Gives you a, yeah. gives uh, you a, a salted exquisite meat gives you an agility bonus damage. Yeah, yeah I know, but uh, I'm doing the strength damage right now. And uh, the salted pork is what gives you the strength damage. It, when it I first like started salt, eating yeah. it, it was giving me the strength damage boost. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I noticed when, you know, it stopped doing that. So I'm not getting the, you know, I'll eat. It just gives me a sated buff. That's it. That color green goes good with that bone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like it. The helmet looks a little goofy, though. The face area. So, where... Are you guys back at... Yeah, you're back behind me? Alright. We're, we're at the crystal let's, let's, uh, area. Ryan, you're getting too far away. Let's go back. Okay. Before they respawn and trap you. Because we're here for the golems. Oh yeah, I brought you that axe. Now you, you brought me what? Does it work? A one-handed axe. Oh, nice. Where's that little hole where you learn that armor? It's way up north. Where'd you go? Oh. Oh. Wow, look at that party. Ooh. Nice. That's Thack. I found Thack on my way back earlier. <laughs> Razor sharp axe. Legendary bleed. Our penetration mm -hmm. zero. Yeah. Shield smash. Health damage 77. Alright. Well, my axe does, a, even though it does 53 damage, I got armor penetration of 10. 10%. But that, I got those. I, I, I put a you know, a, uh... <laughs> what am I doing? Resting myself on my staff. <laughs> Do this. Well, that's the stance for it when you're in a relaxed mode. <laughs> that's interesting. Yeah, Jake, you're, you, you realize you're uh, barefoot? Oh, where am I? Oh, that's a boot from the side. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what, you, uh, your armor got shredded? Yeah, my armor's all shredded. I think it was from when I was going through the jungle to get these dancer, named Dancer and Tanner at that one spot. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's so okay. mad earlier. I freaking killed two missing fingers. Wow. Which are named alchemists earlier. Yeah. I like the I like the color of these. The, they're they're like little green, and then like tannish. That's kind of interesting. That's the bone, just bone color. I like that. Hmm. I gave Thack my old armor. And all my main thralls have the bone armor. The dragon on. <laughs> All my thralls are fitted with the uh, um, the veneer, epic veneer, heavy armor. Well, the the guardian, which is what the short ones wearing, the lady right here. I get a strength bonus. Yeah, 
I'm, I'm mostly because the last thing I do in my attributes is go for grit. You know, mm -hmm. I have zero in my grit. I usually go for the veneer because it does give you grit. It gives you, uh, hold on. Yeah, it gives you like plus five to stamina, plus five to stamina, plus five to stamina. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to give you a stamina bonus. Because I don't need any other bonuses to my hits being because I'm almost maxed out of all my attributes. But what mm -hmm. I do need is stamina. So that's why I chose the veneer. Mm -hmm. uh, what, veneer chieftain? Uh, or... The veneer heavy. Oh, just the basic veneer? But, yeah, basic. Heavy. I, I don't have any other knowledge of anything else other than that right now. Well, the one that's got the red on it, the guy in the middle, which is the barbarian armor, he gives health and stamina. He gives like 20 health on the top three pieces and boots and pants and then could be Okay, stamina. looks like a couple of them has come back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, there are three of them. Four of them. Well, we'll oh, we'll spawn right smack in front of us. Yeah, yeah. I will oh. I'll let you harvest the Rhiny so you get that extra bonus. Thank you. Get us back here, Rhiny. Oh, well, too late. Hold on. I need to go get him. As long as you get at least one hit in, you get him. Oh! <laughs> There we go. Now this should hopefully... Oh, one more point for strength to max out my strength. You'll be... All right, it looks like we got a couple of spawn here. Yeah. These should all be spawned better. I don't know. Here they come. Yes, sir, she should. I'll get it. I'll finish it for her. She can do. Get a hit on him. Go get a hit on him. If we don't get hit by him, hit them. Blood Mad Berserker or Crushing Swings? I usually go Crushing Swings. Just because like, the shields don't stop you from swinging like they usually do. 
Because usually you'll bounce off a shield. Yeah, but I get an increased, uh, my armor would be increased by 50. If I do it with the... I think either one's good, really. Yeah, I chose the wolf for the armor. They were fighting themselves! I've seen that a few times. They just started fighting each other. Yeah. Like, they'll fight the midnight guy, too. <laughs> That's all I need for levels for my, uh... Alright, Oh, Alright, I gotta hit right in. Somebody else? There you go, Riney. Oh, Riney just died. It, it is night time. It is Two hundred or forty-four damage for the hit? Yeah, they did. Yeesh. That's weird. I like my hammer. Alright, uh, Ronnie, do you want to TPR to one of us? Sure, let me... Something else here first. Hmm... Hardened steel great axe, maybe. You got a hammer, a hammer, or something that has a lot of iron thing. Oh, hammer? Yep. Oh, there's a... There's a hardened steel mace. That'll work. Does a little more damage to him. Oh. Oh, wait on her. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna shoot that. Okay. All right. Yeah, let's see how all well this works. <laughs> I might still go ahead and take these guys back. <clears throat> Alright, I did get two so more attribute points. Now I can start filling up my grit. Nice. Yeah. The way I always do my mine is I'll fill up my the expertise first, vitality and agility, strength, and then I'll do authority and grit at the same time. I got one and one. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. I didn't realize it was uh, almost midnight, guys. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, yeah, okay. How about we do this? It's almost midnight, folks, and uh, I think uh, we'll try to uh, get into Isle of Men. When, when's everybody's free moment here? Because we need to all be able to be together so we can finish the volcano. So when's a good I'm time? Free all, I'm free all the time right now. So. Oh wow. Uh, uh, who's free over like maybe Sunday night? Oh no, Sunday night is the uh, watch party. Uh, if you guys want to watch Conan, regular Conan the Barbarian oh. with Arnold Schwarzenegger, having a watch oh. party Sunday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, in my I'm Discord. Oh. Sounds awesome. Cool. We're gonna watch it in Discord. Yeah, why not? We watch all the lot of kinds of stuff in Discord. Yeah. I think for the dungeon, I think we probably just probably just shoot for like Wednesday, like normal. Wednesday. Okay. That's usually the best time for all of us to get to. When? When? What time? Wednesday. Wednesday. So, so next Wednesday night, then? Yeah, I think that'd probably be the easiest for the rest of the volcano dungeon. Well, okay. When, is he gonna, when are we transferring the server to uh, uh, Dark Physicist server? Uh, when uh, him and Crimson finally get together and get it done. Okay. Hey, Ryan. Um, uh -huh. If I were you, I would put a sleeping bag either 
on the opposite end where Minotalius is or in the crystal area. So then you can just spawn back here and level up with the golems. With yeah. The because I put mine way back here at the back. Alright. And it's also an express way to get back up to the volcano. That, you know, mine's back here too, so... Hello? Did you put yours back here? Hello? Uh, you can put yours up here. Like, if you want to put oh, it like okay. over here or something. Hello? Ours are at the opposite end. <laughs> who's, who's, who's here? Hello? I mean, Ray Ray's here. Ray Ray. Ray, 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 Ray. Oh, Ray, it's Ray Ray. Ray. The, only person who's not, the only person who's not talking. The rest is just us in this court. Okay, okay. Yeah, I heard somebody come in and I didn't know who it was, so. Yes, I have a bag. All right. There. There. We're gonna put it right here. Yeah, yeah just go right, right ahead. Here. All right, there you go. And then you can just yeah, die, go in there and uh, on here, and then TP home, and then come back to the girls. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, okay, okay. They're making fun of me again. So uh, yeah, make sure you like, follow, subscribe, and uh, if you like to become a Patreon, there's a link in the description below. And uh, I appreciate that you press that like button, guys. Uh, that would be awesome. And uh, thank you, everyone, for su for your uh, support. I definitely appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you to the bottom of my heart. All right. So we'll see you all later. And you guys have a nice night or morning or afternoon. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Uh, I, I feel like... Uh...